good. Look, Sydney getting her cook on. Go, Sydney. <laughs> That's good. What's up, Basil Babes? It's your girl, Joy. I kind of just woke up, so I got that puffy eye face. Uh, I hope you guys are doing okay. It's kind of early. Well, it's not that early. It's 10 o'clock. And the girls and I are taking a little day trip. So just an overnight day trip. We're supposed to go to a restaurant in Austin, <laughs> but it's raining in Austin and the restaurant is like an outdoor restaurant. So I'm a little bummed with that. So I don't know what to do. So just trying to plan something with the girls. So, you know, I got gray hair issues. Some people are ready to embrace gray hair. I am not at that point in my life right now. So I did not want to be up three, four in the morning trying to, you know, color the front of my hair. I, I just didn't have the time nor the patience because I would have had to take out the front row, take out like 40, 50, 60 braids. I was like, I can't do it. I refuse to do it. Right? I said, no way. I'll do it. That's all I do, my I gotta learn how to do eyebrows, y'all. You know, people be painting on those eyebrows, child. That's all I got for you is a little pencil. I do a little brush up, call it a day. So I went to the store and this is what I did, y'all. I bought some Beijing, right? This is the color, it kind of stains your hair and it, it has proven to work because when I tried to go lighter, it didn't work because my hair was already stained with um, black. So this is the color, I usually use black, but you know, I tried something new this time. And then Beijing, you mix with water. I've been using it for whew, years, well over 20 years. And you mix it with water. So it's a little powder bottle and you mix it with water. So this is the little bottle. I only use half of the bottle, right? I did not take these braids out, y'all. I put that color right up in here, in between the braids and colored my hair. So it's kind of like a reddish in the scalp. As long as it ain't white, I'm good with that. So I could possibly rebraid the front later, but not when I'm so stressed out. I said, I just can't do it. I can't do it. So, and I just rinsed it and shampooed it really, really well. And I thought it was going to actually color this, you know, the, the lighter hair and it did not stain or anything the lighter hair. Nope. So I guess maybe it doesn't color a uh, synthetic weave. So if you in a bond, you just need to do the front. That's my little tip. That's my little tip for you, but you gotta rinse it really, really, really well. Rinse it, rinse it, rinse it. Shampoo it, shampoo it, shampoo it, rinse it. And I focus on the scalp. And then, you know, later I could do a braid or two here. And so I'm a little fuzzy right here. I wanted to try something else. What's my little brush? I need a new baby hair brush, right? So just leave my brush alone. Then I bought this edge effect. Somebody got me some edge control. It's good. It's really, really good, but it will turn white. So you gotta use a little bit, then I have to mix it with oil. So I wanted to see how this is gonna do. I just wanted to try it. And this is extreme hold number five. <laughs> and it smells like pineapples. Bobby said it smells like green apple. I said pineapple. So this is what this looks like. It's clear, clear gel. And baby, I tried it last night. It's good. And people want to call it baby hair. All right there, I call it no hair. Okay, let's just call it what it is. It is what it is, y'all. No hair. No hair, baby hair. Whatever, I know I'm old. I got a few hair. A little bit of hair left. See? Not bad. Now, let's see if this sucker turns 
boy, and it smells good. It smells like pineapple. This is a pineapple, yeah! So anyway, then, I went to check on the girls. Look at the girls. I did cute. You know, so at the end of the day, they still sisters. It is what it is. How y'all do this baby hair stuff? This making my nerves bad. Mm -mm. I'm making a mess, y'all. That's that's it. Then I put some eyeliner, cause I'm out of my liquid eyeliner. Look what I did, y'all. You know, I wear black eyeliner. This is not black. That's white. And you can't return stuff. So I went and bought some white eyeliner. I didn't even know they had white eyeliner. Get with it, Joy. Get with it. So now, this is useless. Useless. So I had to really shake to get the extra bit of eyeliner left out of my little container wasn't happy about that so i just feel like a little pop today so i'm gonna do a little bit of black shake the excess off just do Target from the clearance rack and this was $11 and it has a hood I love it it has a hood on it I love this one you see the hood and I love it and you can have it off the shoulder or whatever and then I just have on these little pants right and I think it's cute it's like it's just okay so I was thinking I might do it when I when I get to the hotel. Me, this is just regular. Y'all know sometimes I like to be extra. So I'm thinking of. Let me show you what I did. Look, I don't got a whole bunch of lights on in here, so forgive me. So then I went to Hobby Lobby. Y'all know how I be cut my sweatshirts. So this sweatshirt here. This is. What size is this? Extra large. So I got this extra large sweatshirt. I cut these. So you cut them, you leave the back a little longer, and I'll show you how I do it. I've done this before, but anyway. And then you cut it, and then it becomes like a little crop top with my little belt thingy underneath. 
So I don't know, I have to see how I'm gonna do it. And you know, you could throw it on one pair of heels. So I have to see. So right now, for me, this is just for me. You do you, okay? I'm feeling kind of like a mommy. <laughs> I feel like I'm rocking that mommy look. <laughs> Some little heels, polish my toes are white. <laughs> and um, all right, we gotta go. We're making some french fries before we hit the road. You, you better eat before we go. That's what you better do. It's good. Look, Sydney getting her cook on. Go, Sydney. <laughs> That's good. You got some cheese up in there? No, but if you want cheese, you got some tater tots. Gonna get some masks. Can you open the trunk? All packed up. Sydney's eating. Well, we just made it to the hotel. See, guys, we're with masks. We just made it to the hotel. So, we're gonna see if we can check in early. If not, we have to wait about another 30 minutes. Sure, if we too early, Basil. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hey, girls. So, we get our key. So, now we're going to get the stuff off the car. Come along. <laughs> Bobby has Bobby has a um, presentation she has to do to the board members, so she's trying to get set up. But she has 20 minutes. It's 144, 145. So she's getting started. I'm not sure. These are brand new eyelashes, guys. I'm working on my eyelash collection. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> I've been thinking about it though. <laughs> I've been thinking about it. So, um, look, the girls are be in this room. Look, the girls. <laughs> and uh, I put my hair up because driving with this hair down is. Ooh, that's so good. You ever have your hair up in a bun or a ponytail or something? You take it out and then it feel good. You scratch them right where you had the rubber band. That's how that felt. So we are, hopefully it won't continue to rain. And then we are supposed to go to the Oasis. What's that for? No. 
Why? Because you always tickle me. I'm not tickling you. I'm just touching her. I wasn't going to tickle you. <laughs> Gosh, they got PTSD. They always think I'm, you know, trying to tickle them or something. I'm not always a jokester. <laughs> All right. So hopefully we can go to this restaurant. It's so nice, but it's been raining out here. But right now it's good. This is 30% chance of rain. So we got our fingers crossed. Look, she nervous. Well, how are y'all? It's great. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Hi, y'all. Baylor, Lone Star College, A&M, and many more. 